Hi my loves, welcome to the Stars Cartel channel. I know you was thinking, so why do you have on the ground? Why, why do you have on the ground? Y'all gonna understand what the message, okay? So, <laughs> let's get into it. Uh, by the way, yes, this is one thing that I had hidden away, okay? I, I had, like, y'all understand um, the message behind why I just had to have this crown and why I hid it away. But anyways, let's get into the message of the dream and then i'm pretty sure the message of the crown matches in with the dream because god told me to put the crown on anywho the uh song that god sent me is pleased by tony braxton okay y'all and this is how it goes i know you're watching all over here trying to find a way to come into my my situation but you should know this it's all good so be cool tell your girl i don't care to fight i got it locked and he's all mine so you should know better than i think i think that you could never put it down like i can if he needs good loving i got it if i need to heat it up i got fire make sure i'm the best for him He's coming running home to me for it. And he knows whatever he wants that I'm with it. And he knows the perfect place to go get it. And he knows that every woman's in me. Fall back and just let me be. I got to breathe. Uh-huh, 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 please. Uh-huh, okay. Sorry if I butchered the song a little bit, but, you know. <laughs> Anywho, it's very hard to speak in, um to sing in Tony's vocals because she her voice is so different from mine. But that doesn't matter, okay? The scripture God sent me to is Matthew 19, 1 through 12. When Jesus had finished saying these things, he left Galilee and went into the region of Judah to the other side of Jordan. Large crowds flooded him and he healed them there. So Pharisees came to him to test him. They asked, is it lawful for a man to divorce his wife for any and every reason? Haven't you read, he replied, that at the beginning the creator made them made male and female and said, for this reason, a man will leave his father and mother and be united to his wife and the two will become one flesh. So they are no longer two, but one flesh. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no one separate. Why then, they asked, did Moses command that a man give his wife a certificate of divorce and send her away? Jesus replied, Moses permitted you to divorce your wives because your hearts were hard. But it was not this way from the beginning. I tell you that anyone who divorces his wife except for sexual immortality and marries another woman commits adultery. The disciples said to him, if this is the situation between a husband and wife, it is not better not to marry. Jesus replied, Not everyone can accept this word, but only those to whom it has been given. For there are Enoch's who are born that way, and there are Enoch's who have been made Enoch's by the sake of the kingdom of heaven. The one who can accept this should accept it. Okay, I'm going to uh, go over this, okay? This is what God is saying, okay? This is for someone. This is not for everybody. It's not for everybody. But somebody, you were um, married to somebody, regardless to if it was a marriage that God ordained and y'all didn't physically get a paper marriage, or if it was a serious marriage and y'all separated. And God is saying, you need to go back and get your stuff, okay? And by your stuff, he is talking about your husband or your wife, okay? Um, God is saying it was not meant for that relationship to come to an end. God is saying that whomever this is, regardless if you are the male or the female, that counterpart of yours has everything that you need. Like, they are literally the answer to all of your prayers. They will unlock the door. Like, they, they are literally the person that you seek they are literally um the that's your someone okay and god is saying go and get your stuff okay so now with the crown 
the reason that I fell in love with this crown, y'all, back in my day, okay, back in my 20s, I used to love watching documentaries on drug lords. Don't ask me why. There was one drug lord that had a crown. Kind of, It's not exactly like this. His was gold, and it had different colored uh, di uh, rubies and diamonds and all kinds of stones going around it. The crown was worth thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars, okay? He eventually fell, of course. He went to jail, of course. He lost everything, of course. But guess what they couldn't find? His crown. And they literally filmed him after he was released from prison. And they asked him what happened to the crown. And he laughed and said, I can't tell you that. Okay, so... <laughs> That's my little inner joke as to why I'm just crazy about my crown and why I really did hide it. Like, I had it hidden away. <laughs> but anyways, for somebody, your boo, your bae, okay, your crown is hidden away somewhere waiting on you, okay? That is literally the message. This person got everything you need. If he needs good, love it, I got it. If I need to heat it up, I got fire. And I'm the best for come running on to me, boy. And he knows whatever he wants that I'm with it. And he knows a perfect place to go get it. Hey. Okay. But yeah, this is so, it's so sweet. It's so wonderful. Now I'm going to take this heavy crowd off. Okay. If y'all don't remember, I bought this crowd for my, uh, it was supposed to be um, for my wedding, but I ended up, I didn't wear it until my 30th birthday, but anyways, yes, okay, I'll see y'all later, thank you guys for watching, be sure to like, share, and subscribe, deuces.